The Tomakomai CCS Demonstration Project, Japan's first large-scale CCS demonstration project, was launched in 2012 by the Japanese government in Tomakomai City, Hokkaido, Japan. The project is being carried out over nine years in the western part of the Tomakomai port. Some 100,000 tons of CO2 was injected each year from April 2016, and the project completed the initial plan of 300,000 tons of cumulative injection on November 22, 2019. <laughs> CCS. Aiming for the practical use of CCS technology, the objective of the project is to demonstrate the viability of a full-chain CCS system from capture to storage and prove that CCS is safe and reliable. The CO2 source is a gas supply facility in the Idemitsu Kosan Hokkaido refinery, adjacent to the Tomakomai demonstration plant. Gas containing carbon dioxide is sent by a pipeline to the Tomakomai facilities. In the Tomakomai capture facilities, an advanced two-stage absorption process was applied. The CO2 absorption tower uses activated amine to absorb the carbon dioxide. The three towers comprising the main equipment in this advanced process achieved world-class energy efficiency. The captured carbon dioxide is then sent to a compression facility to be injected into deep offshore sub-seabed reservoirs. The two injection wells in this project were drilled using directional drilling technology. One well targets the Moibetsu Formation, a sandstone layer between the depths of 1,000 to 1,200 meters. The other well extends into the Takinoue Formation, a volcaniclastic layer between 2,400 to 2,800 meters deep. By drilling the wells from onshore to offshore, drilling costs were saved and disturbance of the marine environment and port activities was avoided. An extensive monitoring system was established to monitor the behavior of the injected CO2, as well as natural earthquakes and micro-seismicity. Monitoring was started prior to the startup of CO2 injection and conducted throughout the injection period, and will be continued after the termination of CO2 injection. Temperature and pressure sensors were set in the injection wells. There are three observation wells, equipped with temperature and pressure sensors, as well as seismic sensors. In addition, an ocean bottom cable, equipped with 72 seismic sensors, and four ocean bottom seismometers are continuously monitoring the sub-seabed conditions. The Tomakomai CCS demonstration project is recognized as a case of the central government, local community, and private sector working together in advancing a CCS project. With the understanding and support of the residents of Tomakomai, the project has attracted widespread domestic and international attention, with over 2,000 visitors to the site each year. Over the course of the project, Japan CCS has reached out not only to the community of Tomakomai, but also other areas in Japan and abroad in order to actively communicate the experience and information learned from the project. The Tomakomai project received the approval of the Carbon Sequestration Leadership Forum, or CSLF, as a recognized project in October 2016. And Japan CCS was nominated regional champion for stakeholder engagement to lead the promotion of CCS in the Asia-Pacific region. Uh, あるいはこれから生まれてくる市民のためにですね、ま、今からしっかりやはりその温暖化対策をですね、ま、やっていかなきゃいかんなと、ま、それに対してしっかり都市として協力していく、ま、そういう意味では苫小牧での実証試験の
、えー、十分あの活用してもらえるようなことになればいいなと。Recently, Japan CCS is extending its efforts to international CCS organizations to pursue cooperation and collaboration with a view to accelerate the worldwide deployment of CCS. <laughs> Through the operation of a full chain CCS system from capture to storage, the safety and reliability of CCS has been demonstrated. ところに CO2 を海底下に貯留するっていう可能性を大きく開くことにつながったのではないかというふうに思っていますね。Looking to the future, the Japanese government is considering the use of the Tomakomai facilities to conduct the demonstration of carbon recycling technology, aiming for the effective use of carbon dioxide. Building on the achievements of the Tomakomai project, Japan CCS will continue its efforts towards the deployment of CCS in Japan. Japan CCS will proceed with the Japanese government and the Tomokomai community in order that the project will continue to play a key role in promoting innovation not only in Japan but the entire world.